This is question 9. Here we get told the Venn diagram shows the numbers 1 to 11, and we're asked to work out the probability of A union B. We can also think of this as being the probability of A or B. So what we're basically saying with this notation, A union B, is we're talking about the entirety of the Venn diagram. What's the probability that I select a number that is contained within the Venn diagram? Again, we can think of this as what is the probability that I select a value from A or from B. So all that I need to do is work out how many numbers are in my Venn diagram and then work out how many numbers there are in total and that will give me my probability. So I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight numbers that are contained within the Venn diagram. I'm told it's the numbers one to 11. So that is eight over 11 for part A. Part B, we're asked to work out the probability of the complement of B. We can also think of this as being the probability of not B. So the probability that it's not B, well, this is anything that is not contained within this part of my Venn diagram. So here I'm talking about one, two, three, four, five, six, seven numbers out of 11 in total. So for part A, my answer is eight over 11. For part B, seven over 11.